First, it was the base, and then the gyroscoping telescope with its impeccably polished 24-inch mirror gingerly brought down from above to give humans the enhanced ability to look back up again. The motors will track the night sky and you'll be able to do very long deep exposures. Sophisticated cameras will soon get mounted as part of this $100,000 project to capture images of nebulae, galaxies and stars from further away than ever before from this location. We send electricity to the motor and that's controlling the motors to actually move the optical tube, which is the telescope. One of the fascinating components of this installation is in fact it is is cheaper in today's dollars to put in than it was back in 1987 when they last replaced this telescope. That's going to perform the rotational twisting this direction. So the mount will be able to move in all directions and the dome will follow that. That's an incredible feat for the technology that we have nowadays to be able to create pinpoint star images on really, really big cameras nowadays to create beautiful photos. And how much better is the experience going to be? It will be brighter, it will be more detailed, it will be less fuzzy <laughs> than it was before. Private donations funded this project, which will be fully operational well before the week of July 20th, when all seven planets will be visible in the sky at almost the same time. The sky above us is the one we all share, and it's our job to be able to present that to as many people as possible. On the lakefront, Ravi Bechwal, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.